What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day or had a great day. Folks, in the last video, we looked at a Gigapan from Sol 3125 Curiosity Rover. Found a lot of incredible and just wild looking things in the foreground. Now, when I looked at the full enhancement of that and while I was editing the video, I saw the background and I said, hmm, there's some crazy looking things back there. I think we need to get back into this. This is the reason why I said, folks, there may be a second part to this video. And a lot of you have commented saying, man, there's something in that background. It looks like giant structures. It looks like some kind of maybe a spacecraft or some kind of weird thing going on. Now, we can't pinpoint as to what these things may be, but are these anomalies natural or artificial? Let's just jump right into this and find out. Okay, this is the video we had done, Ship Like Anomaly and Martian Junkyard. Now, again, we found some really crazy things. This is not the full enhancement, but look at the background. This is what's crazy. Now, folks, I'm going to point something out to you that is just wild. These hills are not hills at all. What I find interesting is why does this part of this ground seem to go into this hillside? See this? Okay. We also have something in the background here. You can see like these little white kind of squiggly lines like this in the back on this far hill, supposedly. But look, it goes into this one here. And I'll put this right in the middle of the screen for you. Right here going white and goes right into the mountain. Back here goes into the mountain. Wait a minute. What is going on here? Why are we seeing things through a mountain or are they there to cover things? Also, take note of this. Why is this weird looking white frame thing or whatever that is right here? Now, it's just weird how it looks like it's cut out. You can see the ground it looks like it does this kind of zigzags go through the mountain. Again, look at this white part going like this into this mountain right here. Comes all the way from the back, comes all the way down, stops here goes across here, and then back into this other piece of land, right? And if you look over here, it looks like a white platform or something whiter, almost looks square, if you back up just a little bit right there, okay? But what I found interesting was that it looks like there's structures here on the top of this area. Again, it's hard to make out what we're even looking at here. This object over here, it's white. We're going to see this a whole lot better. I'll put it right in the middle of the screen. Right there, there's something sitting right there. It looks like some kind of white object. And again, uh, these white areas go right through the mountains. You would think this mountain here would be in the foreground or closer to the camera from the back of this mountain. And that doesn't look like the case at all. So just so people are aware of this, again, look at this part of the ground goes into the mountain. Another thing I want you to take note of right here, coming off the top, looks like a straight piece coming out and then dropping down like a framework type thing. See that? Okay, so we're going to do our best to bring it out, although this was covered for a reason. So the chance of you getting absolute clarity out of this, yeah, um, it's not going to happen. But you can do your best to bring this stuff out, right? So let's jump right into Photoshop and have a look. Again, look at this. This is crazy to me. I'm seeing what looks like it's doing this, okay? Coming down. Now, it's much wider than this line, of course. Kind of does this, and then we can get this other piece coming here. And it looks to be like this here, okay? But it's much wider than that. Kind of does this. Comes over because, again, it's wider. We're looking at it from a distance. We have another part doing this. We have these other pieces down here. And what looks like artifacts or something in here. Again, this is, you can see what, like, this white piece doing this. And it's going into, again, this mountainous area here. It's just crazy how they do these photos, guys. Again, we have this area on this side. Object right here. It looks like it's doing this. And you're going to see this kind of does this. Does this here. Goes over. You, you'll see that a little bit better. Now, let's get into this. This is cool. Now, let's just take away the crappy color. Now, again, folks, check this out. What is going on here that we see this piece doing this? This should end right here. This is supposed a mountain going down like this, right? Again, this piece going off here into the mountain. We should not see that. We have these white pieces right here. It looks like it's on the back of this other hill, but yet it's inside this darker hill. How is this possible? White pieces right here, like I pointed out earlier. I'm going to go ahead and zoom into that. Just the way they're putting these fake hills in here should red flag this big time. I can see something right here. Looks like it's doing this. And going into this hill, we got something white that starts off in the back here, 
and goes into this hill. You shouldn't see that. Again, we have this weird other piece right here. Now, keep in mind, folks, I did not do a thing to this. In other words, all I do is just took off the crappy color. See it? That's all I did. Let's start getting into this, and then we're going to go right into the full enhancement. Okay. Let's zoom into this a little bit and have a closer look. Again, we have these weird parts in here. Now, what I'm trying to do is bring out these the best I can. Okay. Again, white piece is going into this hill. Okay. We have things that look like they're starting to come out up here. Just weird things in here. Something right here. Looks like something actually kind of round is doing this. And it looks like there's another base to it here. It looks like there's something rectangular at the top of it. Like it's kind of got a base to it and sticking right out of the hill, right? And again, we have the way this thing looks is just really bizarre. It literally comes down like this. Looks like it runs past here. Goes like this. And it looks like there's another area. Almost like it's cut out areas on the top of these hills. So let's keep going with this. Let's keep going. Again, notice the other pieces coming into this. These white pieces into these mountains. And folks, the reason why they're putting these mountains here is because they're trying to block out as much as this area as possible. Not sure what to make of this. You can also see this line right here. I'm not sure what to make of that. It's surrounding that part. See that? You can literally still see that right here. And we've got that part coming down, right? Again, let's keep going. So I just outlined a little bit right there. You could see that before I did that. See it? It's very faint, but it's right there. You can see that square around said object. Let's go full enhancement right there. Folks, I'm not even sure what this stuff is, but let's have a look at some of these things here in that circle. On this side, we have what looks like pipes or some kind of weird things going on here. Now, are these in the photo? Let's have a look. They are. Absolutely are there, right here. One coming down. This one going like this. Okay. There's a couple more up here at the top. As well as it's continuing on just a little bit. You'll see that. See? So, what I'm seeing is what looks like something, again, intelligently made. I don't think that these are, when I look at stuff like this, barely in the photo right there, these things here are natural. I don't believe that. And again, we got this right here. There's something right here. The way this piece stops here and goes like, like this, does the same thing here, goes down, and we have what looks like these two pieces, little white pieces right here. See that? Not sure what to make of that. Now, folks, in my opinion, it looks like structures or other objects on the top. Let's back up a little bit. Here's the original. Went to the original for a reason because I wanted to, again, see the way this thing does this. And into the mountain. I, I'm not sure what to make of that. This, if you look right down here in these darker little spots, that is denser manipulation and centering. They literally put this here so that you and I cannot see what's in this photo. It's as simple as that. The only conclusion I can come to is artificiality, non-natural. I'll leave this up to you folks. What I'm seeing, in my opinion, it looks like mechanical and structures in the background because they would be much larger than what we're seeing in the foreground, correct? Folks, I'm going to leave this up to you. What are we seeing here? Again, the way I see it, it doesn't look natural. It's hard to tell what these things are. But they have like a lot of straight lines. Now, can cliffs and layered rock do that? Absolutely. Is it possible, judging by that small piece on the left-hand side on the bottom, it's whitish. We have other pieces that look like it's protruding out of the top of the hill. Are these structures, are they mechanical parts? To me, as far off in the background as they are, they'd have to be something quite large. Is it structures? Could very well be. I want to let you guys tell me what you think it is. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what you see. Please like and share. It is appreciated. And guys, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so YouTube will share it. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace, guys.